I think it is very clear from the debates during this election and from uh, the mandate given by Canadians that uh, we get to move even stronger, even faster on the big things that Canadians uh, really want. Justin Trudeau gets a minority government, but acts as if he just won the lottery. Hi, I'm Brian Lilly, political columnist with the Toronto Sun. In his first news conference after winning the election with the lowest level of support among the popular vote in Canadian history, just 32%, Justin Trudeau was asked a series of questions about whether he would need to work with other parties, should his advisors be replaced? Should he resign as leader given the fact that he called the election to get a majority and instead ended up with a minority with less popular support than his previous government? But when you listen to his answer, you would think that this is a guy who won every seat in Canada. They returned to Parliament uh, with a mandate to do big ambitious, progressive things for Canadians, and I can't wait to get into it. Between the 2015 election and the 2021 election, Trudeau's Liberals have lost about one and a half million votes. Now, it's true, the Conservatives lost votes as well. There was lower voter turnout. Just 62% of Canadians eligible to cast a ballot bothered to do so in this latest election. So all parties were down except the NDP and, yes, to a degree, the People's Party of Canada. But the major parties we're down. But Trudeau thinks, well, this is fine. He, it gives him an excuse to go harder, faster, stronger, more powerful than before. To go even further and even faster. I'm really excited about all the things that we're going to get to do. A plan to go even faster and harder and deeper. Except that's not what the public thought. He asked for a majority. He wanted a majority. That is the only reason he called the election and the Canadian public looked and said, hmm, we're not ready to give you full, unfettered power. He takes it as just that. He thinks that he is going to rule as if he is king. This is a man who is either detached from reality or doesn't matter. To him, the fact that he got more seats than the other parties means he gets to do what he wants to do, and he will try to run roughshod over Parliament. Let's hope that this time the Bloc Québécois and the NDP aren't just rolling over for Justin Trudeau and doing his bidding and instead are standing up for the voters that sent them and their MPs to Parliament as well. Let me know what you think. Drop a comment down below. Share this on social media. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.